From NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Meredith Vieira, live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. The federal government is warning about an alarming resurgence of bed bugs, and it is not just a problem in the big cities either. NBC's John Yang is in Topeka, Kansas, with more on this. John, good morning to you. Good morning, Meredith. The folks here in Topeka are learning they've got something in common with their big city cousins. In Topeka, Kansas, Ed Meese is a bed bug's worst nightmare. How often do you do this? Every day. In 15 years in the pest control business, he says he's never seen anything like it. How much busier are you now? We went from doing 10 a month to up to 40 different jobs a month. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's really taken off. Meese works for Schindel Pest Services, which covers five states. In just six months, Did you want this for today? calls about infestations have gone from about three a week yes. to as many as 10 a day. We have a guest that has reported possible bed bugs. Uh-oh. I have a case of bed bugs. We expected it. We, we knew it was going to come. When you have a society that travels as much as ours travels, it's only a matter of time. A nationwide exterminating company says Ohio is the most infested state in the country. And the 15 most infested cities includes not only New York, Chicago, and Los Angeles, but medium-sized Midwestern cities such as Cincinnati, Indianapolis, and Louisville, and others across the country from Boston to Denver. We're in the heart of America, and, and there is uh, bed bugs here just as there are in the big cities. Many of the chemical pesticides that kill bed bugs have been banned. Here, a demonstration of what experts say is one sure way to kill bed bugs, several hours of more than 120 degree heat. It is really hot in here. What's, what's the temperature about? The air temperature is about 128. You can take a look at some uh, bed bugs we left here on the table. They've been here about 90 minutes and roasted bed bugs. Experts say an effective pesticide could be 10 years away. Until then... We're going to have to develop this consciousness that anywhere we go or whatever we're doing, bed bugs might be there. And the battle against bug bed bugs is even taken to the skies. They're now treating commercial airliners. Meredith? All right, John Yang, thank you.